My name is Tracy Akett. I'm a Child Life Specialist at McMaster Children's Hospital. Today I wanted to talk to you about having children under five immunized. Recently, last week, um, we have a vaccine available for children four and under, and it's important that we just share a few tips on how to support that younger age group. I have a doll with me here today so I can show you a few things. The first thing to think about is what you're going to do for pain management. There are a few options. If you're breastfeeding your child, you could choose to breastfeed before, during, and after the poke. So that in itself can be very comforting. Children feel close to the parent and they won't choke on the breast milk. So, you know, that would be a great option. Alternatively, you could give your child a little bit of sugar water or their pacifier um, just before, about 20 seconds before the injection. And the other thing is if they're a little bit older, so between maybe the one year mark and three, it's still ideal to have them with you and it would be better to have them sitting up. So if they were older, you could have them sitting up beside you and then they would receive their poke in their arm. During the poke, as the person that's caring for them, it's important to remain really calm. Children feel what their parents feel instinctively. So just take a few slow deep breaths yourself, provide a little bit of distraction and, and go ahead and, and get it done and then get a lot, give a lot of cuddles thereafter. In regards to where the vaccine will go and using any particular numbing creams that are available on the market, you can talk with a pharmacist or your family doctor about those products. They have to be put on 30 to 60 minutes before you're going to have the injection. And for children under a year of age, that injection is often given on the thigh and it's not given on the top of the thigh, it's given on the side of the thigh about a third, like if there's, these are three sections, it's in the middle section. So just on the outside of, of the thigh is where they would receive it. And that's important to know so that you put the patch or the numbing cream in the right location. If the child's over a year, then they will have their cream in their arm. And so again, it's not right at the shoulder, but just a little bit down from there in that soft um, muscle, muscle part, that's where you would put the, the numbing cream for those locations. So just keep those few things in mind. You know your child best. If your child is between three and five years of age, they may do well with using some of our tips that we give in our another video on our website for supporting children over five for the COVID vaccine. So be sure to check out that video. Lots of great information for you and your child to ensure that they have a good experience because having needles and getting injections is an important part of life. And we wanna be sure that we give them the best possible experience every time. Thanks so much for joining us. Take care.